What is good everybody and welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Today I am going to show you the brand new WWE action figure backstage arena area and I'm super proud of it. Um, I don't know if you've seen all the other backstage videos I have done. If you haven't, go find those videos guys. I think a lot of you guys do enjoy them so if you have not seen the first ones, I recommend you go check out the others. But we've made a few changes to the arena. I added the GM's office, which we will get into. I added um, a few other things, so I will just show you around the arena. So let's go ahead and get the tour started. Alright guys, so starting out first, if you come through the curtain, if you do remember, the curtain used to be in the middle, but we have moved it to the right over here. Um, when you come through the curtain on your right, you'll have a monitor screen with some chairs. That is for superstars to, you know, look at the ring, see when they're supposed to go out. It's more of a uh, gorilla area, if you will, right there. On the left, we have a table with, with a cooler on it. Coming on down, if you get out of that area, you will enter a hallway right here. And you can see it runs all the way back through here. Um, we got an exit door right here, another table set up, um, some storage units with some lights on there. And then if you come around, instead of going uh, to the left, if you co keep coming straight and then you take a left, you will enter the medical um, area right here. And what we have set up over here is a trash can full of crutches. We have a stretcher right here. Um, we have another stretcher. We have a wheelchair, a uh, doctor's table with a rib wrap and a neck brace, along with a chair for the doctor to sit on while he works on the patients. Um, I want to do something right here, I'm not exactly sure, but right now I just had that cage accessory so I threw it up instead of having this mint sort of background um, to give it sort of a wrestling feel. Um, before you take a left down that hallway right there, you have some more storage units right there. You have a garage door to enter the locker room. And then you have, if I walk around here, you will see there is a little space right here. And that is where you take a left down that hallway. So on this side of the wall, you will see um, this custom built wall and it has an MDT chair. It has a storage unit with some cameras on it, another storage unit. And then right here you will see the MDT general manager's office door. And if you see the wall, you see where it's gray and black. I painted it this way and put the bricks like that so it would match the other um, Extreme Sets background right there. If you would like to pick up that background, go over to ExtremeSets.com. You will get 15% off with promo code MDT. So that's just a heads up if you would like to uh, purchase that background for your WWE backstage. Um, right here, going like I said, if you go through the MDT General Manager's office, you will enter into the MDT GM's office and that is with Eric Bischoff chilling in his desk right here. We did do an in-depth full review of this office if you would like to check that out. Um, I think it was like two days ago so go check that out if you have. But here's just a quick little run through if you haven't seen that video. Um, we got this custom built desk in the middle. We got some accessories on his table. We got an MDT contract, the money in the bank contract. We got uh, his iPad right now. I'm still waiting to get a, a laptop accessory. And on his shelf back here, I wanted to um, add the title belts of MDT, I guess, since I don't have really any other accessories. Check the wall. We have the pick fed posters up there. Got MT, MDT Live on the left and Vindication on the right with their respective championships. Got a trophy to symbolize our togetherness in the middle. And then we have the MDT Trap poster on the wall right here. Coming onto this wall, we have an Eric Bischoff portrait, a lamp over in the corner, and then we have this TV monitor for Eric Bischoff to watch the show while he's in his office. And that is pretty much it. He does have some accessories down below to respect some legends in WWE, but that is just uh, for the time being until I can get some more accessories from Hobby Lobby or something like that. Um, this wall right here on the other side looks a bit rough. I would like to buy the same exact uh, scrapbook paper or whatever that was used for this wall to put over here that way it will not look so dumb but that is it for the GM's office and then if you come through the GM office door and go across the hall you will enter into the MDT locker room you see with the MDT logo right there so if you enter through here you will have the locker room area you got the garage door the lockers some uh, seating area round table chairs in the corner and then a bench for the superstars to sit on and then the little caged area so that would not be black right there but that is pretty much the entire arena I would like to make the locker room bigger 
Um, the best thing I could do would probably be to uh, extend this out. I would like to get rid of this closet, honestly. That way I can extend the, wall, uh, the table all the way to the wall and add more depth to the backstage like I used to have. But um, I'm still proud of it. I think it works very well. I love the addition of the GM's office. I would love to know you guys... Uh, comments on the backstage do you enjoy the new updates we have made if you did let me know down in the comment section below leave a like subscribe for more epic wwe and wwe figure related videos and i will see you guys in the next video thank you